Hey everybody, this is Atomic Zero of Addicted Loot, and we're playing Total War Warhammer, our green skins let's play. I've been doing a few interns behind the scenes, trying to get to something exciting to happen. So, as you can probably guess, this exciting event is going to be the Gitznik quest battle for Grimgor Ironhide. His army just got to the point where he finished recruiting everything he needed, and I figured it's probably the best thing to do at this moment. Gitznik is, of course, his giant uh, two-handed great axe, shaped in the... Demon's Forges of Zara Nagron. Nagron? Nagron? Yeah, Nagron. Grimgor's mighty axe, Gitsnik, has never grown dull despite its constant use. He's been wielding it the entire game, but we won't ask questions as to why he's get it, just going to be getting it. Now, that being said, before we get started, I have ex some exciting news on the Addicted Loot front. We are officially a Green Man Gaming sponsored partner, which is absolutely amazing. We uh, announced that on our podcast last Friday, but just in case you didn't hear it, what that means for you guys is if you, you if you go to addictedloot.com, use our Green Man link, not only will you get amazing deals at Green Man Gaming, but you also will be given the chance to help support Tom and myself in keeping Addicted Loot up and running. That is the website, these YouTube videos, our Twitch channel, and all that. So I just want to say a big thank you to everyone out there that's still listening and still watching because we could not have done it without you. Okay. That, getting that out of the way, we're going to get into this battle real quick. Oh, wait, I guess I have to hit teleport first. Are you sure? Yes. I am made at money at this point. So let's see what we're looking at here. And I got to assemble some. The mortals. Sure. You look good. What's the leadership plus five? Okay, who has the worst leadership here out of 46, 106, 61? I know they're pretty much terrible. Their leadership is so terrible, I'm not even going to bother with it. Which one is this? That's that's the wizard. How about we put him on something I just don't want to break? Uh, yeah, let's put it on a Ragnarok Spider because he could use it. So let's look at what we're going up against here. Realistically, in the historical terms, the Battle of Blackfire Pass. I don't know if Grimgor was actually involved with it, but I know Sigmar himself was actually involved with it. So keep that in mind for who actually should be on the human side here. Let's see. We have a what? Is this? Oh my God. War Priest. I uh, wonder what kind of spellcaster this guy is. But we have another one of the wizards here. I got my... He is a hex wizard. That means he, I think he's a bright wizard then. I love the steam tanks. Steam tanks are one of my favorite units in this game. The Luminart of Heshk. Awesome little thing. Actually magnifies the power of the sun into a beam. And of course we got some dwarves coming in. Some catapults. And nothing really else to really be worried about. A master... Special as a master, oh my god. Siege weapon marksmanship expert, and then some gyrocopters. Oh, we should be able to do this pretty easily, but let's get into this and just see what we're getting ourselves into. I haven't actually done this one yet. Well, obviously, I haven't done this one yet in any of my games, so I'm actually kind of thrilled with this. I actually love this map a lot. I love the aesthetic of this map. I actually think they did a lot of great work on this map. But that is another cool thing with Total War Warhammer recent news is just that they just released some uh, custom map tools. A lot of people are in the community are already out there putting together some pretty awesome maps. I really need to break into it myself. Let's just see. And boom. Oh, this is it, boys. Time to give this emperor a right spanking. Me and the immortals will lead from the front and seek out that poncy crown wearing git riding his big pigeon. My axe, git snick is somewhere in that pass. A bag of teeth to the orc that finds it and hands it over. Any of you think you're gonna keep it instead, well, you'll find my boots so far up your ass, you'll be tasting squid lever until you die. Which will be straight after. Anyway. Let's give Gork a show. Get smashing! I want this pass filled with blood. I want the Zulis to remember my name for years and years. Remember Grimgor! Well, after that exciting speech, I'm trying to think, is this... Since I bypassed my sound issue, I've actually had to do something with my uh, video recorder here that now I can't actually see my frames per second but I have a feeling this thing seems like it's kind of let's just say it's it's moving as slow as uh, molasses going uphill in January you know what I mean 
That's an old-fashioned one of them sayings there. But, you know what? It might be a little less cinematic, but I feel like it's going to be better for us in the long run. So let's just see. Our squigs. Oh, lovely little creatures. I love these guys. Oh, I'm so glad they put these in because this was like one of those units that was people were begging to be put in. I wish it was in when it was first launched, but it's not too bad now that we actually have them. Okay, so let's get down the business. Not really sure where are the dwarves going to be coming from. If I had to guess, I'm assuming they'd be coming from one of the sides, probably over here, considering there's a dwarf entrance looks like over yonder so yeah i'm gonna say over on that direction so we just have to stomp these guys pretty damn quickly so with that being said that was not the guy i wanted let's get ourselves some doom divers love it okay i meant all of you guys uh how about you get over here no over here you guys just don't want to deploy do you uh, okay, well, we'll just do this the hard way then. They're gonna be our flanking force. Let's just see. You guys, I'm just gonna shift you guys all the way up, because I can't remember if they come to me or I have to go to them. Honestly, I don't remember. Let's just see. Grimgore's gonna be... Front and center. We got our other melee specialist gonna pull up this flank. Let's just see an Arachnorox spider and our giant. Gotta get those guys over there. Oh, and all of course all of our black orcs. I mean how can we how can we go into battle with all of our black orcs? What, you guys don't deploy now either? Oh come on. Is it alt? Yes, it is alt. You can probably tell that. I take long breaks between these videos because I always forget the controls. So to do that, we're gonna pop a pause real quick. Uh, just no, I want these guys. Just do whatever you can get. You don't need to do much. So we're gonna take these guys. Four. Thank you. You guys go right up. Let's just see. Oh my god, come on. Get right up there. One and two. Get you guys on the flank, get you guys on the flank. You and you. Uh, I need, let's just say, you need to take out that guy. You need to definitely take out that guy. Grimgore, go kill things. You also go kill things. And we'll get you. Oh, well, well then, might as well just get this puppy going. We're greenskins. What the hell are we gonna do? Wait around? I don't think so. Let's just see. Do we have the curse of the bad moon? We do have curse of the bad moon, but it's a little ways away. And that is the luminar, luminar of hish. Oh God. Let's go kill. Don't see the stunties yet. Come on. Get your butt over here. Oh, they're gonna try to come? I don't think so. They have no idea what to do. This is great. I want all of you three to kill those guys. There we go. Okay, now we're getting into it, boys. I forget where he can put
If you didn't know this yet. Oh. Can you guys kill this thing, please? I want you also go to kill that. I need you to go kill him. I need you also to go kill him. Okay. Oh, the squigs are so are amazing. Love that. I have to love the squig. Please go kill them. You're killing them. You're all okay. Good. You're all killing that stupid thing. So how about we take you, pull you guys out back on the flank. Why? I need you guys to go kill things. We're getting a little bit of damage here, but at the same time, what do we care? Go have some fun. Go eat. No, you, you. Or even better, go kill them. The best thing is about these squigs, they actually can eat dwarves. Which is amazing. You guys go... Oh, he's dead. Okay, great. Go kill. Go kill things. Do as I say. Kill all the things. Let's just get a glimpse of these squigs. Uh, I think they're broken anyway. Is that it? Or is someone rally rallying? Isn't that it? Yep, I was going to say, I thought that was it. Okay, well, our Black Orcs took a little bit of damage there. Everyone else kind of came out unscathed, surprisingly enough. But that was the Gistic battle. That was the Battle of Blackfire Pass. Uh, I just kind of <laughs> green waved them <laughs> off the battle map. Let's just see, anyone get really surprising number of kills? 68? Actually, no. People were just kind of... 76. That, that guy was running the front line. Grimgore probably did well against their actual generals here. Which is exactly what you want Grimgore to do. Grimgore is the ultimate anti-hero. Or the anti-general uh, there. He is ridiculous, ridiculously insane. I'm not sure if he ever got debuffed or if he actually got nerfed in any of the patches. But he used to be like... You could just send him straight into battle and just let him wreck havoc on any one of the enemy units it was pretty insane but have to love him he's such a beautiful little bastard isn't he hooray i would prefer some unit replacement thank you and boom he's we got our gisnik safe from the distance behind him oh yep we're good gisnik's good that's it weapon gain boom he is attached let's just say okay he's probably gonna sit there can you please get into, there we go, just so that we can recruit up. What are you doing? Have you been getting everything? No, you are not. Okay, so let's get Woundmaker one more time. Boom. Let's see, what are you getting here? Oh, that's right. We want him to be a bodyguard. So now we need you to really just be uh, a killer. That's really all we need. Um... Yeah, sure, why not? Make you live a little longer. I don't want all my generals to die. Never a good thing. Okay, so... Did I already move him? Yes, I did. So we actually have... We have a quest to kill this guy and get a really nice blade out of it. So I'm hoping to actually kill him. But we do have... Kolex Sunny. I'm like, I blanked out on how to pronounce his name. Like, holy God. Kolog. The Kolog Cheerio of the Sun Eaters. Yeah. 
we got him down here. So we still know Chaos is out there. Um, I actually wanted to take as I threw the vampire counts, but other things seem to have reared their ugly head. I'm trying to get this guy back up to fighting strength, fighting capacity. Uh, I actually do need some better recruitment. Uh, you need to be basically upgraded instantly. So let's just see, and let's get some of the fighty guys, because we do have some people coming in. I'm not super worried about them. Even with these guys, we should be, they should be up and running in a turn or two, which is what I like to see. Uh, we're still turning around about 13,000. I'd like that number to be a little bit higher. Zulfbar's about to rebel. Uh, not terribly surprised about that at all. It's really, I don't really care. Uh, let's just see. I actually think there's anything... Oh, we have a goblin over here. Kind of trying to run his way to a quest location for us. So, it's kind of in this general area over here. Somewhere, if I do not recall correctly. Oh, yeah. It's this one, I believe. Right? Character in... Yeah. Somewhere there. So, he's doing his quest. I think he's just going to be running up and around through this pass. And then... So on and so forth. So with that, I don't think we have anything else else left to do. So let's just see if we can get into another big battle here. Now, I do want to really look at that map creator tool, just because I wonder if people have been like redesigning some of the correct max maps. <laughs> All the max, no maps. Now, talking is hard sometimes. You know what I mean? Late on a weekend, snowed in. Ooh, peace treaty, yeah, new. No. You all are gonna burn, and I will eat you as a barbecue. Dare approach me. A sacrifice of Gork and Mork. You Unless you're gonna increase your. Uh, I wonder who's number one. It's probably uh, Warriors of Chaos, because they always are. There. No. If they only have one settlement left, you will be dead momentarily. No. Oh, they're raiding me. Ooh, I'm so scared. I need to get. Oh, and we have a rebellion. Oh, interesting. I really need a second army over here, but this is where uh, Grimgore's going to be coming. So I'm not too worried about that. Grimgore's going to be making his way over here once he's healed up. He will be my second army to kind of shear up this flank. Yeah, 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 yeah. Everyone is unhappy. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Okay, are you up and running yet, or do you need... No, you need one more turn. Well, actually, you know what? You will be... You'll be up and running, because you'll heal up as we move. So I'm just going to move them out. Curse of the Bad Moon, what's it do? Just decreases, cooldown. Yeah, I don't really need that. Man, mushroom caps. Dodgy geezer. What does this do? This can't chance. Eh. Not, doesn't, don't really need it. Let's just see. Additional 5% char damage. Nah. Meh. Nah, sure. Come on. Oh, if I force march them right, they're not going to be able to. Just get your butt up here. Ready for yeah, It'll take you longer, but we should be able to... You know what? Just go into Barrack Bar. That should be all you need. Okay. The problem is, I'm not going to catch up to this guy. If I keep on bouncing up and around him... I'm never gonna physically get into contact with them. You think I would, but I'm not. Because I feel like I'm just gonna keep on bouncing over here, just gonna keep running around, running around, running around. I'm not too keen about getting uh, as I here in a point where he's gonna be taking damage, but I don't know if I can avoid it really, unless. Unless he come, came up here and actually attacked, I won't be able to hold him in place. I may just want to let him, let him sit there. Are these, these guys are enemies, aren't they? It's a neutral army. I'm, I don't really care that they're there, realistically. But, let's just see. Interesting, I wonder if those are my rebels. They might be, in, in all actuality. I also got a batch of rebels up here. 
Okay, I thought I could get them up. Oh, you're slowly recruiting anyway. Boom, always need more of those. Uh, not gonna really get me much upgrading that. I'm not sure why it was built in the first place. Where is this one? Crack, Kern, you. So, yeah, we'll, we'll see if we can get that in time. Just to beef them up a little bit, just in case those rebels decide to sh rear their ugly head and just be little pricks. Which is kind of what uh, green skins are. So, uh, if only I could kill off that bastard. If I need to, ah, let's just see, 11, 11 and 9, uh, how much do I get? I get 5, yeah, that gives me an even 20, I'm not going to be worried about that then, I'm not going to uh, bother myself with it. Okay, so I got to figure out what I'm going to do with Azag here. Let's move him, never mind, I wanted to do that in underground, because I want to be able to actually, maybe, maybe I can intercept him, maybe I can run him down next turn. That would be hopefully the goal. Maybe we might be able to get one more end turn out of this Let's Play. At this point, I'm really just moving for the uh, campaign objectives, trying to get all the settlements I need. I need like one other, really? It's not even. Supposedly, it's not even worth fighting, so I'm just not even gonna bother fighting. Unit replenishment, sure. Wow. We basically wiped him out. Awesome. Love it, love it, love it. It could also be because this is in medium difficulty. I'm not really sure what I'm looking at here. It's apparently, it's a really nice spot of ground. That's fine. They're gonna just ransack it. I forgot it's not walled, but... They did a lot of moving and attacking that round. There's no way they could get that far away from us. Yeah, 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 yeah. I hate how... And look, you're fine. So close, I just want to kill all of you. What did they do? Apparently just didn't do much of anything there. Okay, that's fine. You're all fine. Grimgore, you moving up. Go, go do your thing. I might have to... Huh... He's over here. He's doing fine. Let's just get you up and running then. You got yourself some foe seeker. Indomitable, why do we have that? Eh, I don't even remember getting that, honestly. Uh, sure. I want to get you some guides once we... Okay, we do have this up and... Okay, darn it. I want to get him a few more guys. That should be fine. But I realistically, I should find. Let's just, you know what? Let's just recruit another lord. I have the money for it. Night Goblin War Boss. I forgot about those guys. Uncompromising. Ooh. I, you know what, let's try a Night Goblin War Boss. We haven't done this yet, so boom. On the way. Woo. Huh. Yeah, you need some recruiting. You need it now. Uh, Four boys are fun. Not gonna really matter at this point. Um... I need that. I need the help there. That much I definitely need. May I take out one of the golds? It seems so it seems so wrong to take out something for gold. Eh, screw it, we'll just 
We just need to get what we need to get. You know what I mean? I probably... You know what? I should have moved him over here. Meh. We need a new recruiting center anyway. And I think this is... You know what? This is probably where we're going to leave it today. Uh, probably bring it up. What I'm planning on doing... It, I'm probably just going to marathon one of these Let's Plays at a time. Just to close them out. Just to get them done and over with. Uh, I don't really... I'm, there's a few more games that are going to be coming out this month and next month that I really want to cover. So I'm just going to try to get these out of the way before I get them on hold or just get as much time out of them as I can, get as much investment as I can because I know some people still watch these. There are a few of you, but thank you for watching them. But until then, I have been Atomic Zero of Addicted Loot. Thank you for joining me. Please like, drop a comment, or even better, subscribe. But until then, see you later.